when the sunflower stars started to disappear, causing them to be listed as endangered, it was caused by a disease. And there's some indication that that disease might have been related to uh, some warmer waters around that time, the warm water blob, it was called by oceanographers. And uh, it was an unusual event of warm water throughout the Northeast Pacific and in our region. And uh, that was coincidental with the onset of this disease, which we don't understand. It's uh, kind of a unique star for a variety of reasons. It's a voracious top predator in a wide variety of ecosystems. It's one of the largest sea stars in the world. It's one of the fastest sea stars in the world. Like when you think of sea stars sitting there attached to a rock and not doing much, like these are very, very mobile and very active. Yeah.